Hey, so what's up everybody? It's Lee here. Um, and I just want to say, hey, welcome to the next video. We're going to be out here working on the sim rig. So we got a couple things to do. First off is going to be mounting the whole power strip. So that's going to be done. Um, but in the meantime, I just want to say, hey, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, this is coming at you guys after the first episode of our new podcast with me and a couple friends. Uh, and that is uh, Back of the Burb. So, obviously, it's about my friend Suburban, and, you know, he's going to OG, like, 81 Suburban, and we're just recording and having a good time with that. Um, and the idea is, is that we've got all this accumulated knowledge and experiences and all this old dumb stuff that we used to do all the time, and we always talk about all that stuff and everything else and all the new stuff. So, we're going to be hanging out and doing that stuff, but uh, anyways, uh, let's get to work. So, uh, first things first, let's uh, get to drilling some holes over here on this power bar. Choose your fighter. Lakey inspired. Fight. Fight. Okay, so back in the basement, we got that drilled out. So as you can see, we got these right here. So the objective with this is we're gonna mount them up with uh, these little guys. They were for like the corner bracing of the frames, but I, they sent me some extra. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna mount them. So they'll be sitting somewhat like this and I'm gonna mount it to frame. Um, unfortunately, I'm not really gonna be able to show this only because of the location. It's not the best location for it. Um, because where I have it going is actually down here along the side of the frame. So the idea is that we have it, um, you know, it's right here and then everything plugs in and it becomes kind of nice and self-contained. So I'm just gonna cut to that because there's no easy way to film it with, you know, just looking at the space here. So we'll be right back. Okay, so now that we've got that done, that's one step done. So now what we gotta do is we gotta remove the seats. Uh, and then after we remove the seat, we actually gotta remove the wheelbase because we finally got the good one with the, obviously the red anodized metal. Like, the right one the way it's supposed to be so got the new seat finally to go on no more bucket seat and then the new wheelbase so uh let's get to cracking on that now old bucket seat and now we have the reclinable seat from uh, track racer for this mount so this will be a lot nicer than obviously what was on there um, first uh, we got to get the new seat rails mounted and so uh, let's get that done Okay, so it has been a day. 
Uh, <laughs> long story short, I got the seat on. Uh, I didn't kind of... Uh, I just stopped filming that. I was getting real mad. The seat rails are a pain to get those to fit just right. So next thing up is to go ahead and do the wheel mount. So we're going to be getting rid of this, getting rid of this. We have the actual nice one with the billet aluminum pieces where it bolts to the sides here. Um, Got to do that. It'd be way nicer, way more adjustable, not so bendy, twisty. Like it's hard to tell with this thing right here, but this thing flexes and bends pretty easy. Obviously, I don't have a wheel on it. I'm not playing. So uh, let's get that going. It's just this fish and toko highway loop. So now you can just give her, you're on the highway. <laughs> so we got dad's first time trying the simulator out. Come here, you. Yeah, look. 
Look, let's see if we can get a catch in. Let's see if we can get a catch in. Catch! Oh, wait, what? Wait, come here. Where are you? Bowser, get... All right, you know what? It's okay. What do we want? What do we want? What do we want? We want a hedgehog? <laughs> oh, no, let's go with the lemur. Oh, there we go. All right, all right. You ready? You ready, dude? Oh, with the catch! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> with the catch! 